I'm going to go to bed here. Um, uh, anybody out there that's reasonable and intelligent and uh, faithful. I know it's hard because of all the Wi-Fi and then the developmental, dis the, 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 the neuro they put the toxins in you for you to assimilate the toxins with vaccines and stuff. And I know that's hard on you neurologically, psychologically. Uh, to I, 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 no, me and vaccines, whoa, boy, no, it's not good. Um, they don't cause autism. Either. They don't kill me. They they just make me sick, and they they they're very debilitating to me. So, I have to avoid them. And uh, so you know, I, I, yeah, it's, I can recover from amazing things. But I asked, you know, the Suzuki tells it's love, and Jesus tells me that too. It's love. That's what that makes make your baby, your body, be able to recover, your mind to be able to work so um, compassionately and intelligently, even through the most intense abuse and everything. It's love. As far as billionaires, I don't know. I can't. It does not look like there is any cohesion, any cooperation, or any caring. It's just like they're all fighting because they're addicted. And um, I'd like to see some change. I'd like to hope that uh, you know the Jeff Bezos guy, who's the CEO thing or whatever of YouTube and, and Google, that he might uh, look to try to get these some of these people to change and talk to him and say we really are fucked and maybe you know I. I but I can't say you know. Um, I'm not a billionaire and I'm not a home invasive technology person that manipulates people to keep my position of authority and, and, and leadership through money and technology. So I can't tell you I, uh, that's clinical insanity and I'm not clinically insane. So I can't tell you what's going on in their brains. I, I hope, you know, I had a lot of hopes with the kids at Facebook, but it just got worse. And then when I told them the symbiotic relationships between children and answers. They thought I crossed a line and I'm like, you guys are business partners of people that came into my house and abused my family emotionally, mentally, and sexually with technology for your money. And I cross a line when I say, hey, you might want to watch it or the technology might turn on you. Okay, guys, I love you. I'm going to bed.